It's a fun top. I feel like I look like a rich auntie. The movement on these shorts, so pretty. I wanna drink mimosas. Is this ugly? Today, we are on a mission. We are thrifting for summer clothes. We are at Goodwill. We are going to see what we can find and I will do a try on thrift haul. You know all the good stuff because I love thrifting. Hopefully the thrift gods are on our side today. Every time I go thrifting, I wear a thrifted piece. This is my thrifted piece today to help bring me good luck. So we'll see if it works. I have to stay focused and remember summer clothes because I will always find something out of season. But today we're trying to stay focused on summer clothes only. So far, I have a few things. This is obviously not summer, but it's really cute. I still have to like go through these and I'm not done shopping quite yet, but feeling okay. I am so tempted to get this like Wonder Woman like dress thing. I will never ever wear it. What if it's like Halloween? And like, I don't even watch like whatever that is, but I'm like, that's so cute. Like, can you picture me in this? I can't, I won't. I want to so bad, I won't. <laughs> Lots of floral, which I guess is spring, summer. I don't remember if I said spring or summer, but same thing in LA, right? We're doing round two of Goodwill. I'm looking for springtimey something or another. <laughs> Whoa. Whoa. I got it. Of course you always want like more, you know? But it's pretty good. I'm excited to go home. It's <laughs> So we're gonna go home, wash this, try it on. You know the deal, give a little haul. I love when the seasons change because that means I'm going to do a thrift haul. Okay, cut the chit chat, let's just get into it. I went to a second hand store and I got four items from this place and all of it equaled to under $30, but I don't know how much each one was. I don't know what it was, but I really had in mind that I wanted clothes to go out. Oh, this looks good on camera. I got this <laughs> sparkly dress. It is from Forever 21. It's like two pieces. There's a black dress underneath and then over it is a sheer sparkly mesh dress. For this, obviously the dress is kind of the main point of wearing it. It's not like I can really layer it or what have you so the best thing to wear with this dress is confidence <laughs> so we'll see if i can bring that because girl that's already asking for a lot um <laughs> it's cute i feel like the length is nice with this i would wear a black leather purse she's cute i feel cute and i cannot wait to wear this out because it's cute the second going out piece that i got like look at this tell me what you think this is it's literally one piece of fabric. It ties around the neck and then it also ties around the bottom. This brand is Sincerely Jewels and she's cute. I feel a little bit worried that I like the concept more than I actually like the garment. Look at me, garment. Yeah, when I was a child, I used to watch America's Next Top Model and Project Runway. So that has greatly influenced me. Anyways, back to the garment. Okay. <laughs> the material of this is 97% polyester and 3% spandex. Okay, so here it is. It looks good, but it does feel a little scary to know that there's zero support and if one string on this gets tugged it's gone but she's cute and i don't really know how to style this part of me is thinking like a nice black skirt i know i could wear this with jeans but that does feel a little bit expected this top is so cute the cut around the chest area is a little bit um weird on me but i don't know if that's my fault or whose fault that is i don't know maybe it's just how i'm built like i don't know as i build my wardrobe i will be able to have other bottoms that go with it it, but for now, I'm really happy with a black skirt. I feel like it's a little understated. It's a little um, slutty, which is kind of also fun. It's a fun top. I feel like I look like a rich auntie. And isn't that the ultimate goal? I want to look wealthy. Me and my 97% polyester top. Girl, <laughs> I don't think I'm fooling anyone. That's fine. So at the same place, I got two pairs of workout shorts. I just got one basic pair of Nike shorts. They're nothing special. I want you to go on more walks in the spring and be outside and be more active. So getting something cute that's a neutral color that will go with anything is nice and she fits fine you know it's really nothing life-changing but what more could you expect from a plain black pair of shorts next are these shorts these are fun because they have these like little like spandex biker short type of things under it and this flowy material that goes over it these are from joy lab which i think is target brand and i like this 
color. I like the flow on this. When I picked this out, I was like, maybe I'll like start running. I don't know why I was so delusional, but in my mind, running so free, like the movement on these shorts is crazy. I like to have a neutral color, like the black shorts. And I also really like a nice pop of color, just in case like I'm feeling crazy that day, you know what I mean? So next is my Goodwill thrift haul. This did take two different Goodwill trips. That's fine. It doesn't even matter. I'm going to show you perhaps my favorite thing from the Goodwill thrift haul. Look at this white top. I love any shirt that has bows where they tie at the top on your shoulders. I think it just looks so pretty. Like it's just pretty. Why are we not doing this more? It's pretty. It's just this white top. There's no brand on it anywhere. So I'm not sure where this came from. There's no size on it. There's absolutely nothing on it, which is fine. It has like this scrunch at the back and the front is like this ruffled, folded over material which is nice because it gives more coverage in the front so you really don't have to wear a bra in particular i really wanted a cute white top because a little bit ago i thrifted a very very pretty like vintage skirt i really want to showcase a little like white lace type of material at the top of the skirt and i feel like this looks really nice and it hits really good and it's cropped but it's not too cropped and i feel like i could really wear this with honestly anything jean shorts even though that's kind of a lot of skin that's for like the hottest day of the summer. I really, really like this. I want to wear skirts with this. Jeans, if I'm feeling uninspired. I don't know. I have like some vendetta against jeans for some reason. Probably because I feel like they never fit me how I want them to. That's not the jeans fault though. That's on me. And I got this for $4.99. <sighs> That's a steal. That's a, such a good deal. I love this thing. I just feel so pretty. I love a top where you just feel pretty. Like I want to run through fields of flowers with this. I want to go to brunch. I want to drink mimosas. I love it. Okay, I love it. Next on the white trend, because I feel like white is very spring. And plus I just like a white top. This is just a white sports bra. This is from All In Motion. I think that's Target. This is $5.99. A dollar more expensive than this white top. Goodwill, you are crazy. You're off your rocker. Next. I got this little purse. I just love a nice cute little like what is this like side purse little mini purse And it has this gold hardware here, which I think is nice There's no brand on this one either got a lot of no names here and on the side here You can make the bag longer or shorter, which is fun I'm really trying whenever I go out I don't bring my nice purses because I bring them out and then they get dirty and I get sad and then something gets spilled on them And I'm like, oh my god, why did I do this? So I like to thrift little going out bags or this is just nice for springtime because it's so light and neutral and it's very pretty. This is just an easy one to throw on whenever. And I love that this isn't white because it's not as harsh as a white. I really like this. I got this bag for $7.99. We have three more pieces to go through. I know that this style of top was kind of like so last year or maybe even so 2020. I don't care because one thing about me is if I like something and it's out of season, it doesn't matter. If you like it, get it. If it's something that makes you feel good, wear it with confidence and who cares about the rest? This wasn't even to anyone else this was just to myself to make myself feel better that's embarrassing this is a wild fable top she has these cute little ties in the front it's like this stripy material thin and stretchy and i felt like it would be really good for spring i just love a little bow a little tie it's fun so how i am planning on wearing this okay so my go-to is a black skirt and maybe a black top under it i love a quick outfit like you're running late but you still want to look decent so this is one of the outfits that i would put on another way is jeans again ignore my vendetta against jeans but jeans would be a simple way to style this although i really feel like that is so 2020 but i would still do it because it would be nice i think jean shorts would be really cute with this i could just see myself like going to a park or something in this i'm not really like going to many parks but um if i did i I would wear this this is a really nice color purple which i have to be careful because sometimes shades of purple really wash me out but i'm going to be adventurous okay and this top i got for a whopping 6.99 speaking of jeans and my vendetta against them that's like the fourth time i've said it whatever and jeans are really really difficult to thrift i try to thrift jeans very rarely do they work out and then i end up just paying like 70 dollars at american eagle to get somewhat decent pair of jeans and yet even though i have a hard time thrifting them i refuse to give up one day i'm going to find the best pair of jeans i've ever had in my entire life and they're going to fit like a glove like they were made for me and unfortunately that day has not come yet and the day still is not here but this is like this is good enough this is a pair of jeans from old navy these are the curvy og straight secret smooth pockets I really like the wash of these jeans. They're like a nice light color. I'm not really a fan of super light wash jeans or dark wash jeans. I don't know what it is. I just like this nice blue 
color. I feel like these jeans fit like fine. It's just a pair of jeans, you know? And I feel like Old Navy generally actually has really good jeans. And I know once upon a time, everyone's mom was like super obsessed with Old Navy. And like growing up, my mom loved Old Navy and I was like, oh, I hate Old Navy. And now I'm like, I kind of, I kind of get it, okay? I get the appeal, okay? I, I was a hater and I can admit when I'm wrong. And Old Navy has nice jeans. I would wear this like with what? Ever. Honestly, like literally whatever. It doesn't have to be the most insane outfit ever, but a good quality pair of jeans is life changing. And I have yet to find that really perfect pair, but I am still looking and I will never stop. And these jeans cost me $9.99. We have one last thing here and it is a dress and this screams spring. I love this pattern. It has like ruffles on it. The only issue is I'm so unsure about this dress. In theory, it's an amazing idea. And at the top, it's one shoulder and it's scrunches here and I love how high up the ruffle goes and there's a skirt underneath and the skirt is like this nice cream color. The flowery pattern is just so beautiful but when I put it on something just does not feel right. Like, I feel like it looks a little weird on me. Does it look weird on me? This is a genuine question. Please be nice but like I cannot tell. I don't know. I kind of wish it wasn't scrunched in the middle right there because I feel like it makes it look a little cheap. It just feels like a weird placement. Clearly when I take the shoulder off and I put it around my arm i think it looks better it's obviously not meant to do that because then it's like saggy in some places and i don't want the dress to be saggy like that's an awful word saggy does this look okay does it look weird should i keep it should i exchange it i don't know like in theory these are really good concepts it just feels like it has so much potential but it's like missing the mark somehow this dress is from lulu's also this dress was 10.99 which is i feel like a pretty good price but i'm just like is this ugly is this something i should keep i don't know what to do i need some advice because it's very pretty. I don't know. I don't know. I just need help. Please help me. Um, that's scary. <laughs> I hope you enjoyed the spring thrift haul. And if you want more, just let me know. Even if you don't, I can almost assure you that there will be a ton more. I have to stop talking or else I just, I just won't stop. I'll just, you know, I'll just cut myself off here. I will see you next week. Okay. Bye.